South Korea's a trendsetter in tattooing. If you need proof, Brad Pitt and the lead singer of Coldplay are some of the stars that came all the way to get inked by local artists. Interestingly, tattooing in most cases is legal here in the nation. Chang Taehyun has the full story. From cats to flowers, these images look different from what often pops up into people's minds when they hear the word tattoo. Artist Panul is a tattooist who knows how to draw creative works using thin lines and vivid colors. These unique and artistic designs show why K tattoos are trending in the global market. Panul says that before the pandemic, half of her clients were foreigners who came all the way to South Korea for a tattoo. There are lots of talented tattoo artists in South Korea, so foreigners come to Korea for a tattoo tour. They get one from here and another from there. Some people get tattoos on their surgery scars to cover up incision lines with flowers or brighter images. It's not just an art, but a way to cover up one's pain. But despite stories that in global trends, tattoos are actually illegal in South Korea. There's a precedent from the Supreme Court in 1992 that says tattoos are a medical procedure. But to make that plausible, all the products used for tattoos should be medical supplies. South Korea is the only country in the world that says tattoos are a medical procedure. And this means that no one in the country can legally give a tattoo. The Korean Medical Association says that since tattoos involve injecting an ink under the skin, it's partially a medical procedure as there's a risk of infection. Meanwhile, other countries see it as artwork, offering sanitary education and constantly checking if the artists are following hygiene guidelines. In the U.S., tattoo artists should take online hygiene education every year and pass a test to earn a certification of hygiene. Including semi permanent tattoos like eyebrow tattoos, around 13 million people in South Korea have received some kind of tattoo. That's about one out of four people in the country. But there are problems that come from tattoos being illegal. First, since artists can't pay taxes, they're not protected by the law. As some clients know that it's illegal, they could threaten the artist for money or even commit sex crimes. Another problem is that there are no COVID-19 prevention guidelines for tattoo workshops because they're undocumented. Seoul's tattoo technique is on point and is loved by people across the globe. But laws and policies are not keeping up with reality. Chang Taehyun, Arirang News.